Hey, welcome back. So, what what we have done last time? We got the last comic number, and um, I want to make one more thing before we'll go do a little bit of testing because we have done so much and we haven't tested, which is not really good. I would like to write um, a constructor for our class, but the thing is, when you will be doing a constructor in the class which was which inherited from the other class, then its constructor will be overridden. So what we're going to do, we're going to have our ini self um, also will get the URL, but we don't want to override it, we want to use those variables. We need the URL, we need the contents, because we'll be using them constantly in our XKCD parser too. So what we're going to do, we're going just to to call explicitly here the constructor for our downloader and just send it to self, the self and the URL. And now everything is going to be super cool. So my proposal is the following, like let's keep the last comic number, let's not return it from our function, let's just keep it here. So we'll create self, last, oh, that's cool, last comic number, by default it's going to be none, okay. And here we need to make a change. I'm using Sublime Text too, so I can make a multiple selection and write um, at the same time um, in <laughs> different places uh, by editor by click by holding the control button and clicking uh, anywhere. So I can then write. Cool. Yeah. So just. A little trick and also we'll need in our like let's keep in our constructor also the title and also the caption which we will get from the DOM so okay that's cool so let's create the next method which is going to be called get title get title Oh no 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 no! I actually told you that we are going to now test it. So in order to test it, you can you can start writing here and making calls to functions and stuff like that. But mm, it's better to check if it's uh, if you're like create a main function for our script. So if name equals to main, then here you can do whatever you want. Let's make it like that. XKCD parser. This is going to be our object. Oh no 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 no! no. Not like that. Boom! Created with them. Oh yeah. Let's specify the URL here for our. Let's get it like that. And yeah, cool. We are sending it the URL, and then we can mm, make it like that, like um, xkcd parser dot get last comic number, and then we can print the self last comic number, and let's see what do we get. We can compile it right here, um, or we can. If you wish, I, I can do it like Control B. Okay, name self is not defined. Yeah, of course, because we are not inside of a function a method. So I'm pressing Control. Uh, so we're getting done. This is not good. <laughs> Let's check it out. What is happening here? So what we got is actually none. So it wasn't overwritten. Something happened. Something happened, and I know why. Because we didn't get the contents. And actually, we have forgotten a really important thing. Like when we are searching, you specify the, your um, regular expression, and also you should mention where from are you getting it. But the thing is that we haven't written like we haven't downloaded it anywhere. We can um, can do it like. can do it differently but okay maybe we'll just do it later for these purposes but 
the behavior was correct. <laughs> okay, so if you want actually to test, we can write right now the um, another function which is going to be get current comic self. And here, what we're going to do is actually really simple. You just call the download function with the self URL because you have specified uh, before. And, um, and here you can call also, which is important, the get last, get last comic number. That's it. Now it's going to be much better. And here in our main function, we are going to just get the current comic, and then we're going to print the xkcd parser dot. Mm, now it's called last comic number. Cool. Let's see. Control B. Still none. Let's see what is happening there. What we have done wrong. What we have done wrong. <laughs> Self contents. Yeah. Yep, yep, yep. OMG, that was so easy. How come? Oh my god, never make those mistakes. There was no variable with this name. Gosh. Let plus. Yeah, it works. <laughs> Hooray. So now you can be sure that actually, what do we have? We know for sure that our page is downloaded. We get all the HTML code. And what else is done is that we can search for, for this DOM and that we have written a regular expression which finds the last available comic, the last the last number of this available comic. So okay, works fine. See you in the next video.